Hey YouTube, and welcome to Altcoin Picks. I'm Jean. And I'm Stefan. Today we're starting a new series where we are going to look at altcoins worth holding in this bear market. We will discuss reasons why we believe these coins are worth holding and why we believe they will recover once the market picks up again. And before we begin, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button and check out our description, our Telegram, Facebook group, and we're mostly active in our Discord channel. Also, before we begin, we're going to be starting a completely new series and we will love suggestions. So if you guys have any input, just put some feedback in our comments below. Yes, as Stefano said, this is a new, completely ser a new series that we've never done before. It's going to be a co-op video where we work together, go over different things. And so, of course, any suggestions, throw them in the comments. So the coin we're picking up today, we have actually covered it several times and it's Binance coin. But we can't really talk about Binance coin without talking about Binance the exchange. Yeah, so what is Binance? It's a crypto to crypto exchange with one of the top trade volumes in the world. So what is the actual BNB or Binance coin used for? So the Binance coin was a crypto coin issued by the Binance exchange and it has BNB as its symbol. It's an ERC20 token and it started with a supply of 200 million coins and it has already burned half of its supply and it's used on the Binance exchange as a trading pair or you can use it to dis have discount in fees. Yes, yeah, so our next one is why do we believe that Binance coin is worth holding? So the pros. First, it's used to pay trading fees as Stefano's just talked about, which uh, for the first year you're getting 50% discount on trades on the highest altcoin volume exchange in crypto. Again, that's during the first year and it's going to kind of dwindle throughout the years. Um, Binance is one of the top exchanges in the world, like I just said, with top liquidity and volume in altcoins. They have a strong reputation for having fairly strict guidelines to add new coins. The exchange has solid customer service. It's super easy to get registered. They have a beautiful and intuitive interface and they have top-notch security. And, and we have to like bring this to our attention because it's it has since had the two atta hacker attacks and then no coins have been stolen during that time. They were able to, to halt the hack and take their coins back. And uh, I know this is like so important because so many people keep their coins on the exchange and we know you're supposed to have a hard, a hard a wallet. And this is just so important that their security is top notch. Yeah, I 100% agree. Also, they have Chen Peng Zhao, who's the CEO of Binance. He's super active on Twitter and is one of the top crypto influencers in the world. Okay. And then finally, Binance will be adding a decentralized exchange soon that will be using BNB for their trading fees. Which is so crazy. So what do I believe are the cons to the Binance coin? This is pretty much just linked with the exchange. So the exchange that doesn't have margin trading, and I don't know if they're planning to do anything about that, but the fact that they don't have margin trading, they won't be, at least for now, the highest volume exchange right now, because it's actually BitMEX or Bitforex, but that might change in the future. They don't ha they're don't; they not a fiat currency exchange, and we can go into detail about this, but we're gonna just keep this short. And it, this, is, this is a really important part is the, coin as it as the years go by it started with 50 percent discount uh discount for every trade the trade fees and after five years that will be gone and that will be a huge incentive that will be going away and i think those are the pretty solid cons that we have for binance coin yeah i agree 100 percent so that's it for our video. We're going to keep it short and straight to the point on why we believe BNB is worth holding through this bear market. This is the format we plan on using for the majority of our videos moving forward, at least for this series. So please, if you have any suggestions or any other coins you'd like us to look at that you think are worth holding or have any strong indicators that they will recover once this bull market or once this bear market ends and we get into a bull market, hopefully soon, um, throw us uh, any comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Please leave a comment down below. Maybe another coin or something that you guys have been talking about. Maybe a future segment that we have been planning. We have a few ideas, but you guys are always welcome for a little input. Thank you. See you next time. All right. See you. Peace.